Good evening, guys. Ash from Britlow Social Club. And if you've been following us, you would know that we are going to deliver probably one of the best apprentices packages going um, at a price that you can't beat. It's currently on SB Tools website for 249 I think. Um, I've gone online, I've gone on eBay, um, gone on a few other sites to see if I could get a better deal. I can't. Keep 249 in your mind. I want to talk for everything and then I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do. Okay. We're going to support the apprentices with some great kit. Um, yeah, let's see what we get. So, first of all, you're going to get this lovely galvanized steel Stanley toolbox. Yeah, great toolbox. Great to stand on if you've got them little re uh, reach places. Listen, if you're 18 stone, it ain't going to work. Okay? If you're a casual 12 stone, by all means, stand on it. Stanley probably recommend don't stand on it but you'll be fine so look let's let's start off with the the premium yeah so this is a 1910 wooden handle so this is a philadelphia pattern marshall town in 10 inches yeah wooden handle right you will appreciate this yeah these are great trails yeah they're hardy um and they've got really good grip on them yeah great trail so that, that, that goes in the mix. Footprint. Now, footprint, if you ever buy anything that's steel and it's made by footprint, your pins, cold chisel, bolster, they are unbelievable. They always have been, and they've been used by bricklayers for donkeys. There isn't anything else out there. There, there what there is. You've got Marshall Town pins. You've got Regini, I think, do some. You've got faithful pins. Listen, you want the Marshall, uh, you want the um, footprint pins, and that is that. So, start off with the, I think that's a, how many inches is that? 10 inch, I uh, no, 10, 10 inch by one inch cold chisel footprint. That's gonna go in there. Four inch bolster by footprint. Um, the reason why I went with four inch is typically a brick is four inches wide, 100 mil wide, or 102.5. Um, and it's a good robust bolster, which is absolutely fine for your blocks. Um, you don't want to, you don't want to get the smaller ones. They're okay if you're doing some detailed work or a bit of chiseling, um, chiseling out of things. But a four inch bolster is more than sufficient as an apprentice to have. You don't need anything else. This four inch bolster will probably do you, you probably don't even need the cold chisel, but the cold chisel is going in there because if you do have to take out any brickwork as an apprentice, you might have to take out some brickwork because it's a bit shoddy. Don't get upset about it, but you've got a cold chisel, take it out and you'll do a great job with this, your bolster. Marshalltown High Viz line. Now this isn't Marshalltown's premium line, because uh, it's a lot more expensive. But listen, your apprentices, you don't need to go and spend £30 on brick line, okay? This is the Marshalltown uh, high vis line nylon. This is about, what's this, 76 metres. Listen, as an apprentice, you ain't gonna be running much more than a six metre run, okay? You ain't gonna be setting out walls that big to start with, okay? Maybe further down the line, you can upgrade and you can go for your W Rose line. You can get the Fleck Marshall Town line, which is a bit more expensive. This is fine. This will do the tree. Um, there is an option with this one. You can either have the green or you can have the pink. Um, but it's only probably it's, it's, it's your decision, really, what's what you want. Um, I typically go for green. Some people prefer um, the pink colours. White um, is what footprint do. But the Marshall Town line is more than good enough, okay? Which will then bring me on to your pins, a set of pins. And these are the footprint pins. And you know it's a footprint pin because it's got a foot on it, okay? Um, I've been to car boot sales and I've picked up pairs of these that have been donkeys years old. And I've looked and I've got them for a pound each and they've got a foot on them. I'm like, do you know what, I'm having them. Yeah, these will last you a lifetime, okay, if you look after them. If you've got pins, yeah, for your line, you're going to want corner blocks. 
at the moment, I'd probably say that these are the best corner blocks on the market. These are the footprint ones, a little window for if you're using your profiles. Um, I think you a lot of, a lot of the time now, um, apprentices will be learning to use profiles moving forward um, with the times. So these corner blocks with little windows, when you set up your profile, you'll be able to see your gauge, um, your gauge mark and your string line on the profile. Now, if you've got if you've got a lump hammer, um, a lump hammer, you've got a bolster and a cold chisel, you're going to need a lump hammer. So, I think this is quite a this is a very good mid range lump hammer. This is the Ox four ounce four pound sorry lump hammer. Um, it's heavy, but it'll get you used to breaking things um, such as brick and block. Funny enough, um, it's I've got one of these kicking around somewhere. Um, it's not a 400 pound one before anyone asks. Uh, <laughs> they're, they're good hammers, okay? They're not expensive um, and they're gonna last you. It will last, okay? You could get a hickory handle if you wanted to, but um, we've gone with this because we've gone for this brick hammer, okay? This is the Ox Grip Pro Series brick hammer. Um, as you can see, it's a, it's a bit similar to its rival, okay? It's a little bit cheaper. Um, again, I've got one of these as well in my toolkit one of my many tool kits. It's a great brick hammer. I've had it for years. As long as you keep sharpening your edge on it for when you're cutting. Um, same goes with your bolsters. Make sure you keep the images sharp. It's a good all round uh, brick hammer on the whole, to be completely honest with you. Um, it's strong. It's um, one piece, just with a grip on it. Um, you can drop that off the scaffold. You're not gonna have any issues with it. I did have, um, I think a silver line brick hammer. Um, and it started to actually bend. <laughs> so you had to kind of counteract with it or bend it back. Um, but yeah, this is the hammer that we're gonna throw in there. The Ox, um, Ox Grip, great hammer. Marshalltown Point and Trout, this is 11.5D. Um, I'm gonna say that's probably a narrow London pattern, some description. Um, Again, this is a great bit of kit. Yeah, there's 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 many on the market, but this is this is gonna last you. Um, this is how many inches is this? This is five inch. So this is gonna you're gonna use this a lot of the time for any flaunching you do. So you you might get some manholes to do. Um, what else? Your manholes. Uh, your uh, when you've got a tiling course, uh, pointing, weather struck, whatever. Um, your point and trail okay great point and trail and it's got what i like about this one is it's got the straight edge from here to here okay so that when you are um pointing you can have that straight edge along your brickwork as you pull it and you get a really nice finish now we spoke about dingers just the other day um and we said that they're really good but they're good for later down the line okay um so we've gone with the marshall town this is a number 82 brick jointer so that's good enough for your brick work and your block work okay um when you've got a bit of time on your belt yeah go and buy go and buy yourself some dingers not a problem yeah um they're a great bit of kit but great bit of kit um the guys over at dinger um, do a wicked job and it's a wicked finish but for the time being don't get ahead of yourself use the basics first because they are great tools and they've been used for donkeys and this is Marshalltown joiner SB tools tape you're not having a, um, the brick tape they are the evil they are evil um, learn your gauges yeah there is no brick information on there okay have to work that out for yourself you need to learn okay you need to learn your coursings you need to know your length of brick when setting out okay normal tape and last of all in the box this is what you every brick layer needs and this is a lovely marshalltown horsehair brush okay when you finish that nice bit of brickwork uh you've jointed up horsehair brush finish it off lovely yeah so all of that kit that we've thrown in, yeah, 
So you've got your horse hair brush, I'm going to put it back in the box. box. Lamp hammer. Your tape. Pointing trowel. Jointer. Ox brick hammer. Cold chisel. Four inch chisel. Bolster. Set of marsh uh, footprint pins. Two footprint corner blocks. Marshalltown line. An amazing 10 inch Philadelphia wooden handled Marshalltown trowel. And an SB Tools cap. A little tray. Just to put your uh, other little bits and pieces in there. And I'll also throw in a free t shirt and some stickers to the first 10 apprentices that buy it. Now, we said. 249. Now, as a special offer to the members of the Bricklayer Social Club and to the apprentices, this has gone from 249 all the way down to 717495. Yeah, now that is one hell of a saving. Okay, we're talking about uh, 70 quid, 70 pounds saving, plus you're going to get the t shirt and some stickers from Bricklayer. Go to bricklayersocialclub.com, go to the members section. Join us, and in that area, you will find the code, okay? Uh, you go and then go to SB Tools and purchase the um, the kit. The kit's gonna come up at 24995. Put the code in, and you'll see it go all the way down to 17495. And that is only for you guys, okay? We've worked hard to develop this kit for the apprentices, and this is for this is for everyone. If Even if you're not an apprentice, okay, and you want to buy yourself some new tools and you want to buy a new kit, maybe they've been stolen, this is what we're doing for you guys as bricklayers, okay? We're getting great, we're getting great tools together and selling them as cheap as possible, okay? So, look, firstly, thank you to Steve at SB Tools because he's the one that's making this happen. I'm helping make it happen. And thank you to all of the members at the Bricklayer Social Club.